Hi, I'm Caroline. Welcome to FYI Newsbyte. Here's what we found for your information this lunchtime. It's official. President Barack Obama is looking for another stint in the White House. He announced his intentions to run for re-election in a special video message on his own website. The video features interviews with supporters and a link for donations. Even though I couldn't exactly vote at the time, um, I knew that someday I'd be able to help re-elect him. <laughs> Um, and that's what I plan on doing. It begins with us is the campaign slogan. It's expected his campaign team will file papers with the Federal Election Commission today. Found at last, undersea robots have located bodies and part of the Air France wreckage that plunged into the Atlantic two years ago. French officials say they still haven't located the black box flight recorders, but have found a large part of the jet that went down en route from Rio de Janeiro to Paris. It was the fourth search effort to find the plane that crashed, killing all 228 people on board, including three young Irish women. Victims' families are welcoming the news. Police in the north are gathering evidence at the scene of the weekend murder of a young police officer in the north. 25-year-old Ronan Kerr died when a bomb under his car exploded in a suspected attack by dissident Republicans. The head of the PSNI has met with the first and deputy first ministers in Belfast today to brief them on their investigation. The politicians have condemned the killing, calling those behind it enemies of Ireland. Energy bills are about to get a lot lighter. The ESB is revealing price changes that could save customers €190 Euro a year. Deregulation means the company that's about to enter the gas market can now begin setting its own prices. Customers must have paid on time by direct debit and receive online bills to get the discounts in full. Tear gas, batons and bullets. That's what witnesses in Yemen say the police used to attack demonstrators calling for the president to quit. At least 97 people have been killed in Yemen since protests began a month ago. Charlie Sheen's live stage show is not winning. The controversial TV star's violent torpedo of truth 22 show tour opened to dismal reviews and fan reaction in Detroit and didn't fare much better on its second night in Chicago. Ticket holders complained Sheen was boring and the erratic behaviour he displayed on TV wasn't as entertaining live in person. It was kind of sad. Why do you think it was sad? Because he has a mental illness. He sucks! Yes, he's a crack. He looks like a vampire. Look at his ass. It's like it's drooping like this. I paid like I paid like a hundred dollars to see this dude. I was like, come on, man. FYI is interactive. From your opinions to news you think we should be covering, we want to hear it all. FYI is available to you 24-7 online for all the information you need to know. Simply log on to tb3.ie forward slash 3e forward slash FYI. Here you'll find the latest stories, video catch-ups, comments and the FYI blog. We're also available to you on Twitter and Facebook. Just log on to the website and hit the social networking shortcuts. Time now for a look at the funniest clips on the web. Here's our top five. At number five, someone's on a champagne rain of pain. Ow, oh God, damn it. Ow, ow, ow. At number four, it's not begging if you say amen after. Before we eat, we pray. Thank you for this food I'm about to receive. And I pray for more food for those other dogs that don't get a lot of food. Pray, honey. Amen. <laughs> At number three, escalator slide, fail. At number two, this little daredevil won't let pesky steps get in the way of feeding time. <laughs> and number one today, when an escaped snake and a dramatic weatherman collide. Snakey, well, I got something for you! I'm gonna pound you! with two parts hydrogen and one part oxygen as we stroll on in through the nighttime hours. And tune into FYI later for the newest downloads. We'll have more on the top stories, plus catch up on today's tech news with Cassie and Paul will be here with the sport. We'll see you back here at six, right here on 3E.